So I will read your question twice. Your question is, what do you think is the biggest benefit of social media for today's youth? Again, what do you think is the be biggest benefit of social media for today's youth? Thank you for that question. Once again, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I believe the biggest contribution of the social media nowadays is that through social media, we could share awareness, especially, our, especially awareness about mental well-being, about mental health. And I believe through social media, as a future educator, I could educate my fellow youth to not let those problems, those to hinder you to achieve your goals. And allow me to voice out my experience. Growing up, I have experienced a lot of challenges in life, including losing my parents at a young age. And because of that, I needed to find work to support my studies, balancing work, academic excellence, while keeping my mental well-being was hard. But because of those motivational on social media and because of the people that surround me, they have helped me to overcome those challenges in life. And I am here, standing in front of my fellow Kasubai. I hope to inspire you that do not let those challenges hinder you to achieve your goals in life. Because as a Kasubai, we are like a bamboo. We may bend, but we will never break. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number one. Next up is candidate number two. Good evening, candidate number two. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Would you like to say something to your supporters tonight? Of course. I want to thank College of Arts and Sciences, my supporters. And I also want to thank my family and my classmates for coming here tonight and supporting me. Thank you. All right. So please pick your question. So I will read your question twice. How can students be empowered to bring positive change to their schools? Again, how can students be empowered to bring positive change to their schools? I believe students can bring positives in our school by being an inspiration to each one of us, to each one of us, to believe in themselves. Tonight, I stand here. Tonight, I stand here as a proud student of this premier university who will work hand in hand with my fellow students and my professors to transform lives, build sustainable and resilient community. Because after all, a true kasubay, ay kasubay tungo sa tagumpay. That's all. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number two. Next is candidate number three. Good evening, candidate number three. Good evening, sir. So how do you feel tonight? Well, you know what? I feel so overwhelmed tonight and seeing the support of my family, my friends, my College of Business and Accountancy family. Thank you guys so much. Well, you know what? I've actually been sick for three days straight. I'm still sick right now, but I've prepared for this. So let's get on with it, shall we? All right. So candidate number three, please pick your question. So again, I will repeat your question twice. How can Hugyao or UA's core values help individuals become responsible, engaged global citizens? Again, how can Hugyao or UA's core values help individuals become responsible, engaged global citizens? Well, you know what? The UA's core values helped us in a lot of ways. 
But in my case, the commitment on the core values truly reflects in me. For I know my purpose and I've driven myself just to be here tonight. Joining pageantry has always been a childhood dream for me. But people doubted my potential, instilling that I am not the standard of beauty. The Mr. and Miss University of Antique pageant made me realize that beauty comes in all shapes, sizes, and colors. Beauty is not something that can be measured by a scale or can be defined based on the color of your skin. It is all about empowerment. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number three. May I call on candidate number four. Good evening, candidate number four. Good evening, sir. Would you like to say something to your supporters tonight? I think they're yelling over there. Thank you, everyone, especially to, the, to my family and friends who are here supporting me. Thank you. So are you ready to take your question? Definitely. So I will repeat your question twice. Who has been the most influential person in your life and how did they shape who you are? Again, who has been the most influential person in your life and how did they shape who you are? The most influential person in my life is my mother. My mother embodies strength, compassion, and resilience. Through her unwavering support, she taught me values of hard work and importance of believing in myself. Her lessons shaped me into a person who I am today. And she is the reason why I am standing here in front of you, pliant as a bamboo. Thank you. Thank you very much from the College of Teacher Education. Next is candidate number five. Good evening, candidate number five. Good evening, Pa. Good so, evening, everyone. Okay, so how are you tonight? It's okay. Okay, so are you ready to take your question? Yes. So I will repeat your question twice. How would you respond to the critics who say, Pageants promote unrealistic beauty standards. Again, how would you respond to the critics who say pageant promotes unrealistic beauty standards? Well, I acknowledge the concerns about pageant promoting the unrealistic beauty standards. But I believe that they are evolving to become more, to develop more, Inclusive and inclusive platforms that celebrate a wide a wider range to our beauty, talent, and intelligence. Thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number five from UA Kaluya Campus. May I call on candidate number six? Good evening, candidate number six. Good evening, sir. Do you feel nervous or excited? Well, it's my first time joining a beauty pageant, so I'm probably very nervous. But at the same time, I'm very excited because I'm able to showcase myself and represent my college, the College of Criminal Justice Education. All right. So please pick your question. So I will repeat your question twice. As part of the UA community, how can you be a resilient and sustainable student? Again, as part of the UA community, how can you be a resilient 
and sustainable student. I am a visionary like the University of Antique, which solidifies its mission to provide quality education while inculcating excellence with integrity and commitment. We Kasubai should foster productive connections and understand diversity as our social responsibility. I believe that we should be united in cultivating values while enhancing our creativity and growth. We all have myriad choices, and I think in collaboration and encouraging cooperation, strengthening values to enhance creativity and growth, we can foster a community like the University of Antique core values, excellence, commitment, integrity, and social responsibility. And I believe that University of Antique is a cradle of hope, pride, and social responsibility, and a shelter of excellent and virtuous generation of Kasubai. Thank you. Thank you very much from the College of Criminal Justice Education. Next up is candidate number six. Seven, I mean. Candidate number seven. Good evening, candidate number seven. Would you like to say something to the crowd? Good evening, sir. I would like to thank my supporters, the College of Maritime Studies. All right, from the College of Maritime Studies. So are you ready to uh, pick your question? Candidate number seven, I will repeat your question twice. In pageants, beauty, body, and intelligence are key criteria. If you had to remove one, which would it be and why? Again, in pageants, beauty, body, and intelligence are key criteria. If you had to remove one, which would it be and why? I had to remove one, I would remove the body because beauty and intelligence Again, let me repeat the question. In pageants, beauty, body, and intelligence are key criteria. If you had to remove one, which would it be and why? For me, I would remove the body because I think I will remove the body and I thank you. I think I would remove the body and I thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number seven. May I call in candidate number eight?
Good evening, candidate number eight. How are you Good feeling evening. tonight? I'm kind of nervous, but thank you for my supporters from the College of Industrial Technology. All right. So are you ready to take your question? Yes. Okay, so pick one. Candidate number eight, I will repeat your question twice. If you could choose a new spirit animal to represent the values of the University of Antique, what would it be and why? Again, if you could choose a new spirit animal to represent the values of the University of Antique, what would it be and why? If I could choose a new spirit animal to represent the values of University of Antique, it would be a dog. Because just like a dog to its owner, University of Antique stands strong with its dedication and perseverance to commit with its social responsibility, with integrity. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number A. Next up, may I call it candidate number nine. Candidate number nine, good evening. Good evening. So how are you feeling tonight? I feel overwhelmed but excited at the same time. And firstly, I want to thank my department who supported me <laughs> at the very first beginning of my journey. And to my family who is present tonight. And to God who answered my prayer. And hopefully, he would answer my prayer to let me win the crown tonight. Thank you. All right. So uh, candidate number nine, please pick your question. I will repeat your question twice. What's something that recently made you laugh on social media? Again, what's something that recently made you laugh on social media? Thank you for that question. As I was scrolling through my social media and my memories, I saw a version of me, a younger version of me about so many years ago. And there I saw my face full of icing and that was brought by my father by my late father i was celebrating my birthday at that time and there i saw a young rhea an, an innocent rhea a naive rhea with no problems to think of but right now i am proud to stand here right in front of you showing what rhea i am now and all thanks to the university who helped me, the University of Antique, who stands for its four core values and helped me instilled with it. So I would be globally competitive in my future endeavor. And I thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number nine. Again, may I remind our fellow audience to please keep quiet while our contestant is still answering their question. Thank you very much. Again, next, may I call in candidate number 10. Good evening, candidate number 10. Good evening. Would you like to say something to your supporters tonight? Thank you for the support, especially uh, for, from my college, the College of Computer Studies. All right, so are you ready to take your question? So I will read your question twice. What is the thing that you are most proud of about UA? Again, what is the thing that you are most proud of about UA? The University of Antique is truly a blessing to us Antiquenos. As a student, 
and a web and future web developer. It is my responsibility to transform my lives. Thousands of lives have changed because of this education, educational institution. The quality of education is the quality of education that this university offers promotes and speaks volume of competent teacher, transformational leadership, and unique curriculum that suits for every anti Kenya dreamer. And wherever I, wherever my life bring me, I'm always proud as, to say that I am a product of the University of Antique. Thank you very much. Candidate number 10 from the College of Computer Studies. And last but not the least, may I call in candidate number 11. Good evening, candidate number 11. So, Good evening. how do you feel tonight? I feel nervous, but at the same time, I am confident. All right, so are you ready to take your question? I'm ready. All right, so pick one. I will repeat your question twice. What is one thing that you think most people have but never appreciate enough? Again, what is one thing that you think most people have but never appreciate enough? The gift of time. The most, the most people have but never appreciate. We tend to rush things without thinking unethically and choose carefully. We know that every moment of our life is precious. So we pause, pause, and give a moment and appreciate every second with your loved ones and make a positive impact and use your time to create new things, explore things, and, in, and improve yourself. Because time is precious and we should cherish it. And I am, I will say that I am Antique's bride and my heart beats with the spirit of a Kasipai. And I thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number 11 from UA. 